Hello everyone, and welcome. Have you ever spent hours working on a SketchUp model, only for the program to crash or your computer to unexpectedly shut down, leaving you with an unsaved file? It's a frustrating experience. Today, we're going to explore how to recover those precious unsaved SketchUp files. Don't panic, there's a good chance your work isn't lost forever. SketchUp has built-in mechanisms to help you recover from these unfortunate situations. Let's dive in and learn how to use them. First, understand SketchUp's autosave feature. By default, SketchUp automatically saves your work every few minutes. The interval can be adjusted in the preferences. To check your autosave settings, go to Window, then Preferences. Next, select General. Here, you'll find options for autosave and create backup. Ensure that Create Backup is checked. This saves a backup copy of your file each time you manually save. Also, check the Autosave Every X Minutes box and adjust the time as desired, between 5 to 10 minutes is recommended. Now, let's discuss how to find the autosaved files. The location varies based on your operating system. On Windows, autosaved files are typically located in your temporary folder. To access this, type %temp% into the Windows search bar. Look for files with a name similar to your SketchUp file, often with a tilde symbol or autosave in the name, and a .skp extension. For Mac users, the autosaved files are often found in a temporary items folder. You can try searching for files with the extension .skp and the term autosave in Finder. If you find a promising autosaved file, make a copy of it before opening it. This protects the original file in case something goes wrong. Open the copied file in SketchUp. Hopefully, this file contains most, if not all, of your recent work. Another helpful tip is to look for backup files. When you manually save your SketchUp model, and the Create Backup option is enabled, SketchUp creates a backup file. This backup file usually has the same name as your SketchUp file, but with a .skb extension instead of .skp. To open a backup file, simply rename it to have a .skp extension, and then open it in SketchUp. This backup represents the last manually saved version of your model. Remember that autosave is your best friend. Make sure it is enabled and set to a reasonable interval. Getting into the habit of manually saving your work frequently is also crucial. It might seem tedious, but it can save you hours of frustration in the long run. If you've tried these steps and still can't recover your file, it's possible that the data is truly lost. However, these recovery methods work most of the time, offering a lifeline when disaster strikes. Thanks for watching. I hope this video helped you understand how to recover unsaved SketchUp files. If you found this useful, please like this video and consider subscribing for more SketchUp tips and tricks. Your support helps us create more content for you. Also, leave a comment below if you have any questions or suggestions for future videos. 